about to leave Already packing, come with me I'm not really asking, we'll get away to a place where So, we about five days ago, long story short, Winter Storm Karen came through and was relentless until she got to speak to a manager and uh, I got real smart to try to drive the van and the problem is that there are hills in every direction I end up getting stuck I'll try to charge the batteries jump it and uh, hopefully the block isn't too cold and it will uh, it'll start right up so all right fam so as you can see the weather is significantly different than it was only a week ago um, so, I want to give you guys a quick update. This is what we got going. I got some low profile PVC mounts for this solar. Marine grade Loctite, like seal, sealant. And I honestly wasn't sure if it was going to work. But man, it landed perfect. I'm super pumped up to business. Okay, guys, this is, uh, this is it. Hopefully, you can hear me because it's super windy out here. This is the PVC mount. It has a spot to affix the the panels to. It's about an inch deep, and then here where the where the shelf is, another inch. So long story short, let me change the angle. There's a C channel that sits here, here, and of course supports the panel itself. And so there was no way I was going to be able to get underneath. Even if I cut an access hole, there was no way I was going to be able to get underneath to put like a wrench in there. It was just going to be a huge issue. So potentially anytime I would have to mess with the wire, check on something, or really do any work on it at all, it was going to be a huge, huge hassle. So I came up with a solution and I'll show you now. This stuff, so this is what I'm going to be using. This JB Weld, it's supposed to be the best stuff on the market for um, for welding metal to metal, aluminum to metal, aluminum to aluminum. And that's essentially what I'm working my plan is to basically glue each of these nylon um, these nylon nuts to the inside to the inside here where I drill the holes to the um, to the solar panels and hopefully this stuff um, as promised gets super super tight and essentially it creates the bond that I need. Okay, Emmy, what do you think of? Uh, let me to zoom this out. What do you think of the bed space? Like it's so soft, I can stay on there my whole entire life. <laughs> it's so soft. Oh boy. Yeah, it's really soft. I wish y'all could come and feel how soft this is. <laughs> how many thumbs up do you get? You heard it guys, 1,000 thumbs up. Good job Uncle David. That's how soft it is. Subscribe to that video. All right gang, it is uh, dusk, it's getting a little bit dark in here. Hopefully you guys can see me. Um, I don't have the dome light on. As I said, I plan on waking up on the 1st in Austin. However, I saw an opportunity and in an effort to keep my word to you guys, I'm heading down to Austin right now. I'm playing in a soccer tournament this weekend. So I figured, why not go down there, knock out a couple days early, stay a couple of nights, test it out. All right, fam, it is, try this sideways. It is, <laughs> this is so silly how excited I feel about this. It is night number one inside the van. Um, and I've driven down to North Austin to meet up free to roam. Um, to meet up Erin to do a little uh, first night van camp along. So she's uh, she's in her rig next to me. This is it. This is night number one. And uh, see you guys in the morning. Well, van, night one was a success. I'm alive, made it through the night. Not too much condensation either. Um, we are parked next to, right behind me, a uh, Panera Bread. We're gonna go get some coffee. First, I gotta get dressed. We 
in it to the field. Hopefully I can uh, get some goals, get some nutmegs, and uh, we'll see what we get. Is that we won our game three to two. Bad news is that I managed to leave my lights on for about an hour and a half and the batteries are completely dead again so um, I gotta sort something out. I am here just kind of hanging out eating some jerky drinking some caffeine watching some YouTube another van lifer and um, really just kind of hanging out between matches. Uh, I found a solution potentially. Uh, my buddy Justin's gonna be over here. He's gonna help me. Uh, I've got jumper cables. We're gonna trickle charge the van, which worked the last couple of times to uh, to get it going. Start it up and uh, just drive it around. <laughs> just try to charge up this damn battery. So fingers crossed, um, next time you see me, we'll be, we'll be charging the, uh, the van get the battery up and get this thing started so I can drive it and uh, eventually I'm gonna sort out what's going on with this short. All right gang, so quick update. I always say, I always say quick update. Here's an update. <laughs> uh, got some, got some caffeine. Got some, uh, some caffeine and I'm feeling right today. Um, so, after about 40, 45, 50 minutes of the van trickle charging off my buddy's uh, vehicle, it started right up, no problem. Today, it started up right up, no problem. I drove to the gym, ran a session with a client, started up again, no problem. Uh, so, it's, uh, so it's good. Um, so right now, I'm in Austin. I'm actually parked at Zilker Park. You can see there's, uh, there's a, a little bit of Zilker Park. Well, that's not the best view, but you get the idea. Um, just getting a snack, sip some caffeine. The weather is phenomenal, so I open the doors for the first time and just letting some air in. Usually I just do the exhaust fan and those, uh, those nautical porthole windows that I have, which creates a really nice, super nice vacation quality cross breeze. It's amazing. So um, just post up here for a few minutes and in a few minutes, I'm gonna actually head up back to Round Rock to finish out this tournament. We've got two more games, and hopefully we can notch a couple of wins, get our six points, and uh, find a first place draw. Um, I'm here in Round Rock. We just finished our third game of the weekend, which we won, and your boy buckled the old onion bag. I got finally got one, my first, my first goal for over 40s, uh, and it was a great goal. It was a great goal, if I do say so myself. So I'm here in the van just hanging out, and I am, foam rolling because over 40s life so so enjoying uh, enjoying the weekend really having a good time yeah. 